Thomas here with Mice Profs gonna give you another how-to video. It is getting closer and closer to Christmas time and I thought let's keep it festive with our next build. Um, technically this is something from Fallout. I've been getting a lot of people asking if I'd make the new Pip-Boy from Fallout and I'm kinda gonna give you what you want. Kinda. My wife's having a contest at her work for a gingerbread build-off and I've been looking at some gingerbread houses at the dollar store, the little kits, and I thought, what if I turned a couple of those kits into a pit boy from Fallout 76? So, with the help of my wife, let's get to building. <laughs>
finished. Uh, I don't want to like, you know, hold it up in front of you and break it or smash in some icing. So maybe I'll put it up here, future Thomas. Yeah, let's spin it too. Definitely not too difficult of a build, but it does require a little bit of creativity and patience. Um, about halfway through the build, I really didn't like the way it looked, and then I got some of those decorative tips to kind of make the um, icing look a little bit better. My wife was a tremendous help in putting this together. Um, she kind of helped me with assembly and a lot of the intricate stuff and brainstorming. Um, she came up with some pretty cool ideas that we then put on there. She didn't want to be in my intro and outro, so it's, it's whatever. Um, there she is. What's up, girl? Uh, but it was something fairly simple. Think about that when you're buying gingerbread houses, especially now close to the holidays or even after. They could be on sale and you could do something really creative with them. Please, if you do something interesting um, or you've seen some other interesting ones, share them with me on Instagram or Facebook or any of my other socials. Um, but maybe you will try and make one of these yourselves and impress your friends with your gingerbread ingenuity. So much so that they crown you champion of the gingerbread contest. Fingers crossed, it's tomorrow. Maybe you'll get some. Yay! And inevitably, they're going to ask you, how'd you make that? You can give them one of these. Tell them, much props. Um, there's, there's not anything for me to like hit you with, so. Merry Christmas from Vault Tech. Peace out!